Welcome to Botany session. The topic is biotechnology and session number 2. Aim of this session is to understand the process of genetic engineering or recombinant DNA technology. Techniques of genetic engineering. In the previous session, we have seen the importance of restriction endonucleases and also the plasmids from bacteria. The techniques involved in genetic engineering is First, isolation of desired gene from donor. This process is very elaborate and after obtaining the required gene, the gene is amplified. That is the amplification of DNA segment. Production of millions of DNA fragments is required for genetic engineering. So this DNA is multiplied. And this amplification or multiplication of DNA is also called cloning. This cloning of DNA can be done using bacteria or by a technique called PCR, Polymerase Chain Reaction Technique. Using this technique, the DNA segment can be multiplied to millions. Next technique, extraction of plasmids from bacteria. These plasmids are the vehicles which carry this DNA. Plasmid DNA is the DNA of the bacterium. Into this plasmid DNA, the donor DNA is incorporated in it and we have recombinant DNA. So, the plasmids carry the DNA segments to the required destination. That is why these plasmids are referred as plasmid vectors. So the next technique is construction of our DNA, that is recombinant DNA. Next step is introduction of this recombinant DNA into a bacterial host. These bacteria are now called transgenic bacteria or genetically modified bacteria. The last step is culturing of genetically modified bacteria to obtain the desired product. 